let me introduce you to the Dyson VA Absolute Vacuum Cleaner. I don't clean my car out very often and the main reason I don't clean my car out very often is because it is such an effort to lug the vacuum cleaner from inside the house, plug it into the extension lead and pull it out to the car to then move it around the outside of the car trying to clean the inside. So I'm going to test out the Dyson VA Absolute and see how that cleans my car. Will the vacuum cleaner win or will my car win? We'll see, it is quite dirty. I'm just gonna show you how dirty my car is. So as you can see, it really hasn't had a clean in quite some time. So I'm gonna see how I get on. I'm gonna start by using the main unit, which is really light easy to pick up and I'm going to take the small roller adjustment first of all and it just literally clips in to the main unit and you can just use the red button and unclip it simple as that you can see I'm just doing it one-handed as well so the Dyson's got two settings we've got the maximum setting which I think I'm going to have to use for the car and then there's also a lower setting so this is the maximum setting first of all you can hear the power on that and then you can flick it over to the lower setting so i'm going to use the maximum and let's see how we go right that's made a good start I want to get into all the corners so I think I'm going to take this nozzle here take that one out click that one in and off we go How much better does that look already? Apart from obviously the stain on the carpet that no vacuum cleaner is ever going to be able to remove. But I'm really impressed with that. That's taken me a couple of minutes. Really, really lightweight. I'm dreading to think how much dirt and dust is in there. I'll have a look in a minute. So the battery life on the Dyson V8 Absolute um, I've been using it on the maximum setting and you can check your battery level here. If you just press the trigger underneath, and once you press the trigger, the battery light for sort of five, six, seven minutes overall from the time I came out and carried on and did the whole car. And I started off with full charge of my battery and it's gone down to one bar. As the Dyson V8 Absolute is cordless, obviously you can take this back inside you can plug it in. I don't mind that it's used two bars of the three of the battery life. I've saved so much time by not having to plug it in. I've saved hurting my back. I have saved lugging another big large vacuum cleaner around. And actually I've come outside to do this and it's started to rain, but it doesn't matter because I haven't got any um, electrical cables from the house to the car. I'm using battery power, so I'm really impressed.